As well as I'm going to talk to you today about how uh, CNN did a good article on um, the UN Memorial Cemetery in Busan and British Korean War veteran James Grundy uh, had passed away in August of, it was either 2021 or 2022, but he chose to, uh, he requested to be buried at the UN Memorial Cemetery in Busan, so his family took his ashes to, um, to South Korea and he's going to be interned there. And along with his, uh, along with his brothers in arms, there. When I was there in South Korea, there were 885 British Korean War veterans buried at the UN Memorial Cemetery in Busan. But I think Mr. Grundy's going to make it 886. He was 19 when he went to Korea fighting for the British Army, and um, and for 30 years he went back to South Korea every year. He went back to Busan, South Korea, to pay his respects and pay homage to the men he served with that are interned there. So, God bless Mr. Grundy and his family, and thank you for uh, helping keep South Korea uh, my second home free from communism. So, everybody's doing well. Take care. God bless and bye-bye. Bye-bye.